to my channel. I'm Jolie Vega. Today's video is me doing my makeup. Just a little disclaimer. This video is not sponsored and it is not an ad campaign. Um, the products that I'm using are products that I've had. Um, and so I will try to list them throughout the video. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please keep watching and please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you're notified when new videos go up. So I already did my skincare and then I did my brows off the camera and I put some translucent powder on top of the concealer. And now I'm using the Jaclyn Hill Volume 2 palette using the shade Perfectionist. So now I'm using the shade Next, or the color Next. And I always feel like I do one side better than I do the other. I don't know. Using my hands, it's like I'm doing the right side better than when I try to do the, the left eye. So now I'm using the shade GRWM. And my original plan was just to use two eyeshadows, but some kind of way things, I don't know, they got away from me. Yeah. So I'm not with nobody Cause I don't wanna hurt nobody 
body. Did it over text, didn't call me. Still got love for your mommy. I know you wanna be somebody, even if you gotta leave somebody. It's all good, it's all good, it's all Most of the things I don't wanna say. I won't be around while you chase. So now I'm just wetting my brush, which I actually needed a flat brush, um, but I think I had used all of them, so I went with this, and I'm going into the shade Ride or Diamonds. forth between the different shades because I'm trying to make sure that I'm blending everything out as best that I can um, and then I'm just going to like clean it up with some makeup wipes and I show my face in the case so you know it's me imitation is a flattery it's just annoying me and I'm too about it and the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil and I grew up by it time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it big wheels keep rolling and rolling outside 29 G5 Seaside I've been losing friends and finding peace so then I decided that I would put my highlight up into the eyeshadow of the inner corner of my eye and I just used the Madison Miller Ofra palette and it has two different highlights so um, I just usually will use both of them because and I'm not even sure what, what the names of them are. But I know that it ain't everybody. I can never love or see a busy body, baby. If you want me, keep it turning up with everybody. Nah, keep it turning on the city, buddy. Yeah, I got feelings for you, that's the thing about it. Yeah, you know that it's over when I sing about it. Yeah, mama used to be on disability, but gave me this ability, and now she walking with her hair high. So then I use that black color temptress to kind of do like a thin liner on my eye. Um, I have a Mary Kay 
eyeliner pen that I really love, but um, it seems to be drying up, and so I just keep messing up my eyes, and I can't find it anyway. So now I'm using my Mary Kay Lash Love Waterproof Mascara. So now I'm putting on some uh, lashes, and I believe they're called Ardell um, Natural, and I used, um, I think it's called Duo Glue. Mm -hmm. excited that I got my lashes on and I got them on really quickly for the first time and then I realized as usual this happened but I decided I wasn't about to take them off and try it again because that was like the second time so just ignore that so now I'm using my Mary Kay uh, foundation primer with sunscreen it does have SPF 15 in it so um, I really do love this primer. my Mary Kay uh, Time Wise Matte 3D Foundation and this is the shade Bronze W130 and my shade like changes so I usually will mix it and you'll see me mix it with um, CC Cream from Mary Kay and this is uh, CC Cream with SPF 15 and it's in the shade Medium to Deep. But I actually think that I probably could have let, left this lighter shade, the CC cream, out today. Um, but but I really just, you know, I just didn't want to take all of that off and start all over. So now I'm using a foundation brush that I got in a box from Morphe. Um, to be honest, I don't know what half of these brushes are because most of them don't have the names on them anymore. So I'm sorry, I can't tell you what brushes that I'm, I'm using. And I like to try to use the foundation brush, but I generally always go back to my beauty blender.
So I used two of the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealers only because the medium beige that I actually really like I ran out of so I used medium beige and I used tawny and I actually thought that I had them turned the right way um, but anyway I don't really like a very bright under eye for myself so um, that shade was it wound up being too too bright for me so you'll see me I keep going over my makeup with my beauty blender you know with the foundation that's still in it and then trying to bronze and everything so that I'm not so bright <laughs> And I probably should have let my concealer dry down a little bit more, but I just became impatient, so... Why is this so far? You wanna get with me, stop 
So now I'm using the Mary Kay bronzer in Copper Glow and usually I'll use contour and then I'll put bronzer on top but today I thought I would try something new and just do the bronzer but then I kind of wish that I had used the the um, contour before the bronzer because I just kept seeming feeling like I was so bright today that I just kept putting on more and more bronzer. So normally I think I would have already set my eyes with um, translucent powder from Mary Kay, but today I really don't even know what order I was doing my makeup in to be quite honest. Um, <laughs> This uh, is kind of a chaotic makeup application day. And the dirt that they took on my name turned to soil and I grew up by it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. Outside, 29, G5, C side. I've been losing friends and fine. So like I said, I just kept going back and forth between my uh, beauty blender with with the foundation on it and then the bronzer and just trying to make sure everything was blended and no lines of demarcation and to just kind of tone down that that brightness because the really bright under eye is just not for me and now I'm using my Mary Kay blush in the shade Wineberry. So now I'm using my Mary Kay contour in the shade Latte. Latte. Um, I like a light shade for contour for my nose and then I just try to keep blending until I'm satisfied.
decided to do my um, setting powder with the Mary Kay translucent powder and usually I'll do my highlighted points but then I'll also set my entire face with it because I've never found it to give any flashback um, so I really like the Mary Kay translucent powder and usually I'll do this step right after I do my concealer but for some reason today I don't know if I forgot but normally I'll do this step and then I'll do my bronzer and my um, eyeshadow, not eyeshadow, but my blush and everything while that's on my face and then I'll dust it off. So I really don't know what order I was doing today. kind of fix the angle of my eyeshadow so I used um, I went back to my foundation for that just to kind of clean it up a little more
doing my um, lower lash line and I actually made it through without getting all teared up and ruining everything so I went back in basically with those same colors um, from Jaclyn Hills palette the shade next and then I believe I used the GRWM and the um, Ryder Diamonds and then um, made sure to go back in with my highlight. the eyeliner in the shade um, deep brown and I'm going to use this for each one of these lip um, lipsticks that I'm going to try but I tried a few different things um, before I wound up with the same thing I usually put on and the first lipstick you'll see me try on is the NYX uh, suede matte lipstick and it's in the shade uh, dainty days 
And this is actually the shade that I'll end up with, uh, but I will end up putting a gloss over it. but I think I took that out because the video was going to be way too long. Um, I tried on Crushed Berry, but I, it didn't go with the eyeshadow at all. So I actually have forgotten that I decided to put on this Mary Kay at Play Contouring Stick on my lips after I put on the um, eyeliner, which I like to use as a lip liner from Mary Kay. And then after that, you'll see me put on the NYX Suede Matte Lipstick in the shade Dainty Days. And then I'll put on top of that the Revlon, the gloss in the shade Taupe Luster. I couldn't get enough of that Mary Kay bronzer and I didn't feel bronzed enough then I just had to go back in there again spray which I've actually heard from people that this is kind of like the um I think it's the all-nighter spray I'm not sure if that's from Morphe Morphe I've always used this Mary Kay finishing spray and it's always worked pretty well so stick with what I know Oh, you're 
So now I'm adding my Mary Kay Lash Love Lengthening Mascara to my lower lashes. And I really like this one for my lower lashes. Thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you're notified when new videos go up. And I'll see you in my next video.